Our role is to be that reminder and that sense of hope. Hope, the four-letter word which Father Greg is always supplying. From homilies to simple face-to-face -face talks, Father Greg is always instilling a sense of optimism into the Siena community, but that's not all Father Greg does. He supports individuals in times of need. You know, you get an opportunity to be people's, be in people's lives at um, their most joyful times, like at marriages and stuff, but also in some real troubling times when they've had a, a funeral or a loss of a loved one. Father Greg always takes a step away to recollect his thoughts and connect to God to better be able to help those in need. Each day I have to center myself. It's not about me, it's about God. And my role is to help connect people with God. Father Greg explained that he gets to hear many personal stories. And sharing with you some of their uh, most intimate stuff that they're, they're dealing with, um, they're dealing with their sexuality, they're dealing with a, 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 a messed up family, they're dealing with addictions, or they're just having doubt. That's where Father Greg steps in to support and aid the individuals in their rough times. Father Greg is a really good um, guidance person to go to. He's always been there. He's always there talking to students, making sure he can answer any questions. Um, he's always there to make sure he can give a guiding um, hand. Yeah, he has a joyful attitude because, you know, whenever we have a down day, he's always there to brighten us up no matter what, always uh, saying some scripture in the Bible, something like that. So. He's joyful. For the green and the gold, I'm Daniel Baki.